It's time, it's time, it's time. For all the people that's melanated, been rocking with me, I'm going to finally reveal where the book of Alexandria at and where the real Egypt at and who and how it all began. This is my gift to y'all. Now, first, we got to start right here. Washington was originally named Rome. So when you hear all them stories about Babylon, it was true. Here it goes, right here. And then you got to start right here. Francis Pope was the original owner of the land of Washington, D.C. Now, if you're looking at this picture right here, this was the original Pope right here that owned Washington, D.C. And if you ever was wondering where the Library of Alexandria was really at and how the white Pope got all them books, I'm about to explain it to you. As you can see right here, everything is Alexandria, Virginia is where the Great Library was. Now, if you don't understand, Rome and Egypt was one and the same. And as you can see right here, Alexandria of Egypt, as you can see right here, is coincidentally, Alexandria in Virginia is the same map. Now I know what you're saying is, right here, right, is Alexandria, right? But where is Egypt on this map? It's right there. Can you tell? Can you tell? Look at it one more time. Look at it one more time. All right. Can you tell where is it? It's in your face. Okay, I will draw it out for you. Now, can you tell they had Egypt hidden? All right, let's go right back. Can you tell? Okay, I'll give you one more look. Can you tell? All right. Now, do you see it? Now you know why your pastors been meeting up in Washington, D.C. They've been meeting up in Rome, Egypt, the whole time. As they can say, black pastors betray community. Okay, I'll pick another map. You see it's on this map right here? 1776? 1788? I draw it around for you. You don't even see it, do you? Okay, Washington, D.C. should not have a Cairo, right? Washington, D.C. have a Cairo? They have a Cairo.